is it Kaiser Duke? Are you gonna be my first favorite? Should I tell everyone that you're my favorite favorite out of all the favorites? Oh, you want butt scratches. Okay, well, you know what? Can I film my video and then we can resume butt scratches in approximately 30 minutes? Can we do that? Is that okay? You have a very nice butt. Thank you so much for showing it to me. I'll give you all of the butt scratches when I'm done filming. Is that okay? Can we agree on that? You still just want the butt scratches right now? <laughs> Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel, or if you guys are new here, welcome, my name is Katie. Today we're doing a favorites video. This is all my favorites from May, and I have such a big variety of stuff from clothes to perfume to body care, wellness, the creators that I've been loving lately, some jewelry and everything in between, so I'm really excited to share all my favorites with you guys. Everything that I do show will be linked down below if any of you guys want to shop it, and then I typically also will pin it in the comments as well, just so it's easy to find. So with all that being said, let's just get right into the video. So so my first favorite that I've been absolutely loving is this Osea Undaria Collagen Body Lotion. And I'm actually super excited because I'm partnering with Osea for this video. Like all the brands I talk about, but definitely Osea as well. This is a brand and product that I'd be sharing with you guys, whether this was sponsored or not. Like I am a ride or die Osea fan. Like they have a cult following for a reason because they're just so good. But anyways, like I said, this is their Undaria Collagen Body Lotion. And I really like this stuff because it just makes your skin feel so plump. It has a vegan collagen alternative in it. It has hyaluronic acid. It has Indaria seaweed in it. It has a peptides and it really promotes brighter, smoother, and more firmer looking skin. This has definitely been one of my hands down favorites for the summer because when it's the summertime, I don't feel like I need something super heavy. And I like this because it is more lightweight. It's not greasy. It instantly absorbed into your skin. You guys can't really see it because I've been like sitting here shaking it, but there's probably about like only this much gone out of the bottle. And I've been using it for about two to three weeks now. So with that, I will say that like a little Little bit of this goes a long way in my opinion you really don't need to use as much as you would of like a normal lotion i feel like all of osea's products really like last a while so i really like that about them but i also really love them because they're a clean beauty brand they're vegan cruelty free they're plant-based so if you guys do want to check out this lotion or you want to check out osea you guys can use my code katie ucbl i'll have it on the screen as well as down below in the description box and that will save you guys some money on osea goodies it's good from now until june 30th so definitely make sure you guys take advantage of that okay Okay, my next favorite are these sunglasses that I actually recently got from Amazon. I love Amazon sunglasses because they're super like affordable. I think these are maybe like $13. Hi, bubbies. You coming to say hi to the video? <laughs> you bringing your butt back in? Yes, it's very nice. <laughs> Anyways, but I really like that they're so affordable and I don't love spending a ton of money on sunglasses because I feel like I like throw them in my purse. I've like accidentally sat on some and broken them before. So I just prefer more inexpensive sunglasses, but I really like them because they kind of have like a little bit of a cat eye. They're kind of rectangle but then they're also more like rounded and i just think they're so cute i love wearing these specifically with like a sleek back bun i just feel like it just looks so good together but i wanted to share these because you guys will probably see me wearing these in future videos so in case you wanted to know where they were from or like the link for them i grabbed them from amazon and i have been absolutely loving them my next favorite is this magnesium by moon juice and this one is their very calm plus l-theanine relaxation and sleep little drink mix and for starters when i first smelled this it smells exactly like the pink. I don't remember what the pink Laffy Taffy was, if it was like strawberry or something, but it smells exactly like that. It smells so good. But I have been really loving this before I go to bed. I hate swallowing pills, so if I can find like a powdered version of something or like something I can make into a drink, I so prefer that. And this is such a great way to get in your magnesium. And I love that this one has L-theanine in it as well, which is just like another layer of added calm. So instead of having to swallow a bunch of pills, you just mix a teaspoon of this in with some water before you go to bed and you're good to go on your magnesium. So if you guys need a good non-pill form magnesium, highly recommend this one. I've been absolutely loving it. Okay, my next favorite are these jeans from Abercrombie & Fitch. I love Abercrombie & Fitch jeans. They are literally the only jeans that I will wear because they make curve love jeans. So they're a little bit bigger on your hips. They're small on your waist, which is exactly what I need for my body type. And I love these ones so much. So anytime you guys see me wearing jeans recently, like these are the ones that I'm wearing. They're such a perfect wash. They're like more of a straight leg. And then I really love them because on the back of one of the legs, there's just this like little slit and it's nice because I feel like a lot of jeans make the slits like right up here. It's so, like your butt cheeks hanging out and I don't really want my butt cheek hanging out of my jeans. So I like this one because it's just a little bit more on like 
the mid upper part of your leg so it's not actually like showing anything but it's still like a super cute detail it looks way bigger than it actually is because it's like kind of like hanging but i have been absolutely loving these jeans i got these ones in a size six they fit amazing i truly cannot recommend abercrombie jeans enough to everybody because they have curve love if you do have like a smaller waist bigger hips or butt um but then they also just have like regular if you have like a more straight figure so i really like that they're inclusive of both of those body types because if you guys have smaller waists you guys know it is literally the most impossible freaking thing to find jeans that fit both of our butts and our waist my next favorite is this symbol modern tumbler i have their four ounce tumbler and I absolutely love it but I wanted to get something a little bit smaller to put my iced coffee in if I'm on the go or if I just don't want to carry around like a huge 40 ounce tumbler with me to like bar or whatever it may be so I grabbed this one absolutely love it it's the perfect size it's insulated so it keeps your drinks cold so long it's the perfect like size to fit your iced coffee in the morning my protein coffee but I absolutely love this cup I've been using this so so much it's my new designated on the go iced coffee cup and then speaking of bar my next favorite is pure bar if you guys watch my vlogs you'll have like heard me talk about this that I have started going to pure bar and I absolutely love it it is unlike anything I've ever done and I really felt like I had a lot of strength I was doing like weight training three to five times a week and I've been doing that for months now and I thought that I had like my muscles were built up I felt strong I could go through whole workouts like without getting sore getting super tired and then I went to bar and let me just tell you bar will absolutely humble you if you think that like you have strength of any kind it's so funny the way that they do them at bar is just so different and like my entire body was literally shaking my abs were shaking my legs were shaking and i just love it so much i really like it too because it's low impact but high intensity so if you aren't wanting to do a lot of jumping around cardio it's really great for that i also really like them because they just have so many different class formats so like i have a membership but i can take all these different classes and they're different kinds so i'm not just gonna get bored or like have to do this one certain type of class so they have the classic pure bar which is using like two to three pound weights and then like a resistance band and it's doing lots of little movements lots of floor work bar work and you feel the burn and then they have their empower class which is a little bit more like cardio based so if you are looking for something that's like more cardio focused that's a great one and then they have their reform class which is kind of their version of pilates so they have like bungees that you hook up to the wall and you do lots of resistance training with those that one i've heard is really hard like way harder than classic so I want to try that one after I kind of like you know do classic a few times and then they also have an align class which is more like stretching yoga based with also some like toning exercises in that and then the last class that they are recently launching which i don't know if that's for everywhere or just my location but it's the define class and that's supposed to be more like strength training so you have like ankle weights you have heavier weights and that's going to be more focused on like strength training but i have been absolutely loving pure bar so if you guys have never tried it and you've heard a lot about it go for it be prepared to get such a good workout out of your life like it seems like they're little movements and it wouldn't be a lot but like i promise you you will be sore the next day okay my next favorite is actually a perfume and i recently got this one if you guys watched my last weekend in my life vlog you will see me grab this but this one is dolce by rosie jane but i've really been trying to switch to more like clean non-toxic perfumes versus like the perfumes that have a lot of like synthetic and artificial fragrances in them because those can like have such an impact on your endocrine system your hormones everything like that and like i said trying to balance my hormones Hormones, so I'm really trying to be cautious of what I'm putting on my body So I saw this one recommended all over tiktok and I really wanted to try it and it just smells It smells like such like a nice like warm cozy vanilla as I feel like the best way to describe it it just smells so good like i've been wearing this every single day lately and i think this will also really be a great perfume for like the fall winter time when it's like more cozy vibes but one thing that i really like about this one is because it's more like essential oil based it's really strong you do not need a ton of sprays normally with other perfumes i have to like spray it a few times and then it only lasts half the day with this one i literally can only spray it one time otherwise it's way too strong for me so a little bit of this goes a very long way you literally can't even tell that i've used this at all but i've used it so much so you definitely get a ton of use out of this and it's so worth the money okay my next favorite is this little quilted puffy bag and this okay amazon has recommended this to me every single time that i opened the app so i was like okay 
okay maybe i just need to get it like i've seen these all over i feel like everyone has them and i feel like they're so cute i've really been needing like a good bag to take stuff with me to workouts to bar because i typically will just take my purse but it doesn't fit in like my slides and if i wanted to bring like a jacket or something if it's cold or if i want to bring my camera it just doesn't fit all of that so i grabbed this because it's the perfect size it's just like a big giant tote bag it has little pockets on both sides and i also think it's so cute because it has like little tiny handles as well but amazon finally got to me with the recommendations and i caved and i love it <laughs> okay my next favorite is my go-to necklace slash chain for the summer and just honestly for any time this one is the julia necklace from miranda fry it's a collaboration that they did with julia havens and i'll have to show you guys an up close but the texture and like the design of it is just so pretty it's a really nice like thick chunky necklace but it's not like too big and too obnoxious and it layers so so well if you have like a more like thin gold chain or if you want to do like a little bit of like a longer one with like those cute little letter pendants it's just such a nice staple necklace and i've been wearing this so often every time i wear this in videos you guys always ask where it's from i always get so many compliments on it in person and it's just one of my absolute favorite go-to necklaces so if you guys need a good staple necklace for the summer to wear with all your cute outfits to wear to the beach 10 out of 10 recommend this one okay next up i have some activewear that i've been loving and the first ones are these leggings these are from abercrombie and fitch and they are their curve love leggings these are the leggings I never knew that I needed, but now I can never live without because they're the same things as the jeans. They're smaller on the waist and then they have an extra like two inches that you guys probably can't even tell, but they have a little extra room added to the hips and the butt. And it's just the best thing ever because for me at least, I have the hardest time finding high-waisted leggings that actually stay up. These are the perfect solution to that. So if you guys have a smaller waist, bigger hips or butt, please go grab these they're squat proof they're amazing quality they're really really nice and thick and i also really like them because i feel like they just like snatch your waist like they really just suck everything in i feel like they have really great like tummy control and they're just great they also have little pockets on the side which i personally love on my leggings so definitely worth the money um i don't remember exactly how much these were i think they were maybe around like 70 dollars which is a lot for leggings, but I honestly want to buy more because I think that they're so worth it. They're such great quality. Okay, and then the next activewear piece that I have, I'll hold it over here so you guys can actually see it, but it's this sports bra. I have been getting a ton, it has the cutest little back, but I have been getting a ton of my sports bras and like activewear lately from Target. Surprisingly, they have a ton of really, really great stuff. Like all of their sports bras lately have just been such amazing quality, really, really cute designs and styles, super flattering on. They also have a ton of great dupes for more expensive items right now. They have a really cute dupe for the Aritzia onesie. I think it's the, the shorts ones. And I bought the Aritzia like short onesie. Now that Target's brought out like a perfect buttery soft dupe for it, I literally wish I would have just saved my $100 and bought the Target one instead. Because in my opinion, it's like just as good of quality and it's just as cute. And then they also have a bunch of dupes for the Abercrombie Traveler mini dresses. So like those little athletic dresses you see. And then they also have like ones that are one shoulder and just like so many cute things right now. If you have not gone to target recently go look at their athletic wear there are so many cute things that they have out right now they have a bunch of fun colors if you guys like color but yeah 10 out of 10 recommend going to check out target my next favorite is actually some spearmint tea i love to have a cup of tea every night before i go to bed i just feel like it's very nice and warm and cozy but i've really been loving spearmint because it's actually really good for hormonal acne and there's a lot of like research and stuff like that behind it you guys can kind of google that if you want to know a little bit more in depth but i have personally noticed such a difference in my hormonal acne whenever i use this not saying that this is like a one-stop shop fix is that the phrase one stop shop that's probably not the phrase if you guys get what i'm trying to say like i'm not saying you're gonna drink this and all your acne is gonna go away like i know acne is way more complicated but i have noticed a decrease in like my hormonal acne um i believe it's supposed to work to like block the androgens which causes the hormonal acne if i'm saying that right but I've personally been loving the results that i've been seeing from drinking spearmint tea and it also helps a lot with like your digestion bloating and everything like that okay last but not least i wanted to shout out some of my favorite Favorite creators that I've been watching recently. I was watching Sydney Adams' favorites video that she recently did, and she did this as well. And I was like, I love that because you guys are always asking me for who I like to watch. And for a while there, I wasn't really watching a ton of YouTube because I was just honestly stuck in the comparison game. And I was like, okay, that's not healthy. So I'm just like not really gonna watch YouTube. But I've been back into YouTube and I've been loving it lately. So I wanted to share some of the new creators that I've been watching. So first off, we'll start off with Sydney Adams. If you guys want to watch someone who just like sydney absolutely radiates joy and positivity 
every time i watch her videos like i just feel so uplifted and she's also really big into health content her body is absolute goals but she's not someone that like shares health and fitness content in like a toxic or unhealthy or like make you feel insecure type of way every time i watch her videos i'm just so motivated to incorporate new healthy habits she's like the queen of waking up at 5 a.m she does great workouts and she really is just such a great example on how to live a healthy lifestyle well and not in like a diet culture or a toxic way so i love sydney she's so sweet she definitely gives lots of motivation to be nice and productive to get your workout in to make yourself good healthy nourishing meals and she's just over Overall, such a sweet sweet person so I absolutely love Sydney okay next up I've been watching my friend Michelle Reed's channel a ton and she actually just announced that she's pregnant has a baby on the way so if you guys like pregnancy and baby content she definitely has those videos coming out but she also shares a ton of lifestyle type content in the most calming way I never feel like like her videos are so not hustle culture they're so calming and like homemaking and she loves making sourdough she had like a little herb garden she totally inspired me to have a little herb garden of my own and she's just so sweet she's christian she has the cutest golden retriever cash um she lives in dallas and she's just overall such a sweet person she's another person that is a really like open and honest and vulnerable person so absolutely love michelle she's definitely someone that i watch anytime i feel like i just need to take a breath or watch something that's going to like be nice and calming but also very motivating at the same time she'll do lots of like sunday resets she does lots of like week in her life monthly resets all types of really great content that i know you guys will love so definitely check her out as well okay and then my last favorite creator for this favorites video i have so many favorites i need to find her because i just discovered her channel while i was getting ready for this video okay her name is kylie holbeck 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 i think i'm saying that right and one of her videos was recommended to me on my like homepage. and after watching the first video i had to subscribe because a the intro was the cutest thing of her doing like a little voiceover of what her dog was thinking so if you guys like dogs i'm sure she has lots of content like that but she just seems like a very real open and honest person who like talks about things in a real way but it's not like negative and it's very uplifting and she's also a christian she was sharing like a devotional that she read or like one of her friends sent her i think in like a message and she just seems like a very very sweet genuine like uplifting type of person so she just seems like such a cool person so i'm very excited to watch more of her vlogs and kind of get to know her a little bit better but those are all the creators that i have been loving this last month if you guys have any creators or favorites that you guys have been loving this past month definitely comment them down below i love getting new product or creator recommendations from you guys thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys